Lord Janos has been given a place on the small council. During a session that coincides with King Joffrey Baratheon's 16th name day and the official announcement of the end of the longest summer in living memory, Janos expresses his concern over the influx of refugees fleeing the civil war. He is ordered by Cersei to bar the city gates to peasants. Later, Janos oversees the massacre of all of the late Robert's bastard children. He personally murders Bara, a baby girl, before the eyes of her mother Majen, one of Littlefinger's prostitutes. He also interrogates Tobho Mott, who is being tortured by one of the gold cloaks, about the whereabouts of Gendry and learns that he has left to join the Night's Watch and is heading to Castle Black. Janos sends a small party of men after Gendry. Janos is present at a small council meeting when they receive a request for more men from Lord Commander Gior Mormont. Tyrion later has Janos as a dinner guest in the Tower of the Hand. Tyrion dismisses his squire, Podrick Payne, after Janos begins to chastise the boy for spilling wine on his hand. The two exchange compliments and jokes. Tyrion asks about the incident in Littlefinger's brothel, which Janos calls a nasty business, but necessary. Tyrion feigns agreement, saying that the peace must be kept. However, the discussion quickly turns sour when Tyrion brings up the subject of Janos's role in the murder of Robert's bastards, subtly accusing him of taking bribes from Cersei or Joffrey to carry out such a horrific crime though Janos defends his position and hints that it was not Cersei who gave him the order. He also defends himself for betraying Eddard to the usurpers, claiming Eddard was a traitor who tried to buy his loyalty. Tyrion counters that Slint had already been bought by Littlefinger and the Lannisters, and accuses Janos outright of being entirely lacking in honor. At this point, Slint stands up and threatens Tyrion, but is interrupted by Bronn, who Tyrion claims is the new Lord Commander of the City Watch. Over Slint's protests and threats that he has friends at court who will not stand for this, Tyrion has four gold cloaks seize Slint, informing him that he does not trust him and is sending him to Castle Black to join the Night's Watch. Slint is dragged from the Red Keep to board a ship bound for Eastwatch by the sea.